Industrial companies are moving closer and closer towards connected tech, but according to a new report, cybersecurity is being left behind. For Tech Republican TV Net, I'm Dan Patterson with Tech Republic's Brandon Bialarolo. Brandon, what does this new report say? It's essentially telling us that more and more uh, industrial companies are moving toward the industrial Internet of Things. 40% have already begun transitioning to connected industrial technology, and 24% more plan to in the next year. Unfortunately, uh, security isn't keeping up with that. There's still a lot of siloing between information technology and operational technology. And it's not uh, it's not being considered as part of the of the plan from the very beginning. Essentially, the silos uh, are are existing between IT, which is everything we know, it's enterprise software and hardware. Uh, but the enterprise is only one half of an industrial company. The other half is what's happening out in the factory floor, and that's your OT or operational technology. Those are things like the machines, the monitoring software, the control systems. Um, a lot of times, those don't even have anyone in charge of security. In fact, a number of plants don't even know how many connections their OT realm has to the outside world and what data can move in and out. Uh, and, and unfortunately, like I said, companies that are merging toward an, I, an IoT system aren't accounting for the fact that they're going to be leaving their operational technology areas way more open to the Internet than before, and they're not including IT in that conversation. Now, is this a lack of prioritization, or is this part of the cybersecurity skills gap that exists in all industries? According to the report, it's pretty much a lack of prioritization. Uh, companies that are planning to move in this direction tend to focus purely on the business advantages of connected machinery, and they don't really think, oh, wait, this is going to open up a whole lot of new security holes. So the report actually says, you know, we've, we've seen three major priorities uh, that are business-focused, you know, return on investment, all these kinds of things. And cybersecurity comes in fourth. So this report is basically saying, hey, you know, we need to start bringing cybersecurity up toward, you know, to realizing that it's sort of number two after the business priorities and that it needs to be considered from the very beginning of the integration process. And is there any indication that this will change or is this simply the future of the industrial Internet of Things? The, the lack of integration? Yes. Yes. I, it seems like the, the lack of integration isn't, going to change, at least unless people take a report like this seriously. Uh, it seems that going forward, companies, some have a plan to merge those two environments, the operational and the information technologies, but it seems like a lot of companies still don't have plans to merge the two or haven't even really thought about it. Well, this is a great opportunity for companies that aren't in the industrial IoT space to really integrate cybersecurity before bad hacks happen. Uh, if you would like to learn more about the industrial Internet of Things as well as the future of cybersecurity, make sure when you visit Tech Republic to subscribe to our cybersecurity newsletter.